All right, so this is a $1,000 phone, and the camera that is shooting me is $3,900, which is the Canon R5. And we're gonna do a comparison between this phone, its video capabilities, with the R5 video capabilities at 4K, 24 frames per second. Since the iPhone Pro 12 Pro has been updated with the Dolby Vision HDR, I just wanted to see how that fares against a full frame camera, which is, uh, 4K, uh, can shoot up to 4K 120 frames per second, can shoot up to 8K, but we're not going to do the 8K, we will do the 4K versus 4K. Um, it's not a serious test, it's not a scientific test. Uh, if you are bashing me in the comments like, oh, why would you even do that? Just remember, this is just for fun, and I will say, why not? I, like, I think a lot of people will be interested in uh, check seeing this, how this fares against the Canon R5. Since I had both uh, with me for a few days, why not just check it out? So the iPhone 12 Pro has been set to auto, straight out of the box, pick it up. This is the, what's the shooting it's gonna be. I just wanted to mirror how people usually gonna shoot on the iPhone 12 Pro. With the R5 also, I turned on the camera, the picture profile is faithful and uh, ISO has been set to 100, 1 50th of a shutter, aperture 1.8 on the 35 millimeter STM macro lens. So just to give you an idea, that's, that's how it is. The iPhone has 1.6 aperture on the wide uh, lens and uh, this is 1.8 aperture. So keep that in mind, but this is a full frame. This is a smartphone. Just enjoy the video. Thank you so much for watching ladies and gents if you liked it give it a thumbs up if you disliked it you know what to do but you also know that you can subscribe to my channel there's an 8k video shot on the r5 of the can uh, of the iphone 12 pro so please subscribe turn on the bell notification this is kazi signing out i'll see you guys in the next video take care